Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you my red lip makeup tutorial. First, let's start with moisturizing our face with a regular moisturizer. And here I am using my Prolong Wear Concealer in the shade NC43. And I make sure I'm using my sponge. Here I am using a Studio Fix Powder in the shade NC41. Using a dense brush to set my concealer. And then for the rest of my face, I am using the Studio Fix Powder in the shade NC43. And you can use a fluffy brush to powder all over your face to have that even finish. Don't forget to include your neck when you powder your face. Here I am using a matte bronzer. I'm using an angle brush to apply the bronzer. If you would like, you can include your nose and contour. Then we are going to use a painterly paint pot to prime our eyelids. Make sure it's evenly distributed over your eyelids. Using a flesh tone matte shadow, I am applying it all over my eyelids. Then I am going to use the Anastasia Brow Pomade in the shade Dark Brown. And I am using my angle brush with a spoolie on the other side. If you want to see a tutorial on how I do my eyebrows, just click on the link down below. I am applying a brow gel in dark brown from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And then I am curling my lashes using my Shoe Amora. I am taking a light brown to contour my eyelids just lightly, not too much. Make sure you blend it very well. I'm moisturizing my lips with my Aquaphor Lip Moisturizer. And then I am lining my lids with a black liquid eyeliner. Here I am using my Maybelline Rocket Mascara in black. Make sure it is waterproof. And whenever you do your lashes, always remember that it takes practice. It's to each his own. It is your preference in how you do your mascara. Here I am using a false lashes that is one of my favorites, which is the Kiss Lashes in Organza. And again, if you want to see a tutorial on how I apply my false lashes, I will link that in my description box down below. Then I am using the Makeup Forever 
red lip liner and I am lining my lips how I want my lips to be lined so this is really up to you how you want your lips to be lined whenever I'm doing a red lip I always want to be more precise with my lip The red shade that I picked out for this tutorial is the Stunna Lip Paint Longwear Fluid Lip Color in the shade Uncensored and this is the, the perfect universal red. I feel like this has the right amount of blue undertone to it and I like that this lip paint is very lightweight and it dries matte so it's more long lasting for me. I take the concealer that I used earlier for my under eyes, the NC43 the Pro Long Wear MAC Concealer, and I'm just edging all around my lips. I am also taking that same concealer and I'm lining the, the underneath my brows and above my brows. That way it highlights and it gives it more of a sharp look for my brows. Again here, I have to take my time because it needs to be blended well. Here I'm fixing the concealer that I've applied earlier and I'm using that damp sponge to blend everything in. And I'm doing my other brows with that same concealer I'm just lining underneath. I'm just concealing underneath my brows and above my brows as well. And guys, this takes practice. It doesn't just come overnight. So if you want to perfect your red lip and if you want to perfect your brows, this is the right time to practice it and just keep practicing it and eventually you'll perfect it. You'll perfect your brow shape and the shape of how you want your lips to be because whenever you wear a red lipstick it really shows if it's not even And with that concealer, I am setting that with a setting powder. Lining underneath. And then I am setting my concealer around my red lips. 
anytime that you apply something that is liquid, you always want to set it with a powder. Here I am setting my face with my Milani and that's pretty much it guys for my red lip makeup tutorial and if you want to see more videos just like this please make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys soon. Bye!